Remember 2011? Remember coming home from school and turning on your favorite video game? Remember when life was simple? I do. Life was pretty good back then. One of the things that defined 2011 was the launch of Minecraft. Although we didn't know it yet. It wasn't just a game. It was a portal to a simpler time. A time where all we had to worry about was school, friends, and just being a kid. It feels like a lifetime ago, yet the memories are still so vivid. Back then, diving into Minecraft was like stepping into a whole new universe. One where the only limit was our imagination. Little did we know how successful this game would end up being so many years later. I remember the thrill of booting up the game for the first time after my friend convinced me to get it, not knowing what to expect. I remember the feeling of an undeniable sense of excitement as I learned how to craft my first pickaxe. As the world generated before my eyes, I was greeted by a landscape of endless possibilities, towering mountains, dense forests, vast oceans stretching to the horizon. I was only in grade 8. In those early days, every block we placed felt like a stroke of artistic genius. Every structure we built, a testament to our creativity. Whether it was a humble dirt hut, or an elaborate castle reaching for the sky, each creation was a labor of love, crafted with care and passion. For those of you who played Minecraft back then, do you remember the first time you learned that you had to punch a tree to get wooden logs? or the excitement you felt when you mined your first diamond? What truly made those days special was the sense of community that flourished within Minecraft. We weren't just lone players navigating a digital landscape. We were part of a vibrant community of dreamers and adventurers, united by our love for the game. I remember spending hours exploring with friends after school, venturing into dark caves in search of diamonds, or embarking on an epic quest to slay the Ender Dragon. And even when we weren't playing together, we were constantly sharing tips, tricks, and unique stories, deepening our connection to this virtual world and to each other. We weren't just players back then. We were pioneers, carving our names in a digital frontier. Every mined cobblestone felt like a monumental achievement, the foundation for our grand, nonsensical castles that defied the laws of physics that screamed pure, unbridled creativity. Diamonds weren't just pixels on a screen, they were legendary treasures, a reward for venturing into the unknown depths of the world. The sheer absolute terror of a creeper's hiss, it was more real than any horror movie. A scramble for the safety of our dirt huts, fortresses built with hope and desperation in equal measure. In this one server I was a part of back then, I built a kingdom. I remember other players moving into my kingdom from other towns built around the massive map. The pride and sense of accomplishment I felt in that moment that other players would willingly choose to move to my city over others was unlike anything I have experienced in most games even today. And the friends I made? Priceless. As the years have passed and Minecraft has evolved, those memories have only grown stronger and fonder with time. Sure, the game may look different now with new biomes, blocks, mobs and items, and will constantly be updated with new features for years to come. But the spirit of those early days still lingers in every blocky landscape and pixelated sunrise. Let me know in the comments section a favorite memory you had in Minecraft because I'm genuinely curious. We have all grown up since those early days. Some of us have moved out of our parents' house and got jobs. Some of us now have families of our own. It's crazy to think of how much has happened since 2011. We are in a whole new generation of miners who will punch their first tree, build their first dirt hut, and mine their first diamond. They will experience the Ender Dragon for the first time, but also new enemies along the way. Minecraft might not be the same after all the updates, but the memories we built there as kids, those will live on inside of us forever.